This new Perplexity AI SEO tool is insane and it's totally free. I'm about to show you how to use Perplexity to get your content cited by AI search engines. Most people have no clue about the new features that dropped. I'll give you the exact steps I use to research content, find perfect sources, and get Google to love your pages. This is next level SEO. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below. So why should you care about perplexity for SEO? Simple, the game changed. Google shows AI overviews now. ChatGPT has search, Claude has search. Everyone's using AI to find stuff and perplexity is leading the pack. When someone asks perplexity a question, it cites sources, real websites. Your website could be one of those sources. That's free traffic, free authority, free exposure to people ready to buy. But most people don't know how Perplexity actually picks which sites to cite. A researcher just leaked 59 ranking signals that Perplexity uses. This is gold. Let me break it down for you. First, Perplexity loves high authority domains. Think government sites, major news outlets, university research. If you get cited by these sites, Perplexity notices. It creates a chain effect. You become more trustworthy in the algorithm. Second, topic matters. Content about AI, tech, marketing and science gets a three times boost. Sports and entertainment get pushed down. So if you're in tech or business, you've got an advantage. Third, freshness is huge. Perplexity updates its index every single day. Old content dies fast. You need to refresh your pages with new data, new stats, new insights, keep it current or get buried. Now, let me show you how to actually use this for real business growth. I'm gonna use examples for the AI Profit Boardroom to keep this practical. Let's say you want to research content for a new blog post about AI automation for businesses. Here's what you do. Go to Perplexity, type in a question, like a real person would ask, not keywords, full questions. Here's the exact prompt. What are the best AI automation tools for membership communities and online business owners? Watch what happens. Perplexity searches the web in real time, pulls from multiple sources, gives you a complete answer with citations. Now here's the secret. Look at which sites Perplexity cited, click through to those sources, study their content structure, see how they format their information, notice the language they use. That's your blueprint. Perplexity already told you what content it likes. You just reverse engineer it, but make yours better. Add more data, include real examples, show actual results, give people something they can't find anywhere else. Let me give you a specific workflow for the AI Profit Boardroom. Say you want to create content about how AI helps businesses grow. Here's prompt to number one, copy this exactly. What are the top five benefits of AI automation specifically for membership site owners and community builders? It will give you a list with sources. Those sources are your competitors in the AI's eyes. Now take those benefits and go deeper. Here's prompt number two. Find three real case studies of membership communities or online educators who successfully implemented AI automation and grew their business. Now you've got proof, real examples, social proof that you can reference in your content. Next, you need the numbers. Here's prompt number three. What are the latest statistics on AI adoption rates for online businesses and membership communities in 2025. Get the numbers, the data, the facts that make your content credible. Finally, here's prompt number four. What are the most common questions and concerns that membership site owners have about implementing AI automation in their business? Boom, you just built an entire content outline based on what AI search engines want, and you did it in 10 minutes. And one more thing, if you're creating all this content but nobody is finding it online, you've got a traffic problem. That's where SEO comes in. If you want more leads, more traffic and more sales, my team can help you rank higher on Google. Check the link in the comments and description to order AI SEO online and let us handle your backlinks while you focus on growing your business. Now let's talk about something nobody else is teaching, how to format your content so perplexity actually cites it. This is huge. First rule, use clear headings, H2s and H3s that answer specific questions. Don't be clever, be clear. Instead of a heading like the future is now, right? How AI automation saves membership site owners 10 hours per week. See the difference? One is vague, the other is specific and searchable. Second rule, answer questions directly at the start. Don't make people scroll. Put the answer in the first paragraph, then expand on it. This matches how people actually read online. They want the quick answer first. 
more detail later if they care. Third rule, add real data. Perplexity loves citing content with statistics, surveys, research, studies. If you're write, writing about AI automation for the AI Profit Boardroom audience, include numbers like how many community owners use AI, how much time it saves, how it improves member engagement, give specific numbers with sources. Fourth rule, use FAQ sections this is massive. At the end of your content, add a section with common questions. Answer each one in two to three sentences. This gives perplexity multiple opportunities to cite your page. You're basically feeding it exactly what it wants. Fifth rule, keep it conversational. Write like you talk. Short sentences, simple words, first person, when it makes sense. AI search engines are trained on how real people speak. So speak like a real person. Let me show you another powerful strategy. External links, perplexity tracks, which sites you link to. If you link to authoritative sources, it makes your content more trustworthy. Here's the exact prompt to use. Go to perplexity and type this. What are the most authoritative and credible sources about AI automation for online businesses and membership communities? It will give you a list of high authority sites, MIT Technology Review, Harvard Business Review, Forbes, McKinsey, those kinds of sites. Now in your content, link to those sources, not random links, strategic links that support your points. When you make a claim, back it up with a link to a trusted source. This tells perplexity your content is well-researched. It's credible. It deserves to be cited. But here's the key. Don't just link for the sake of linking. Make sure the sources actually add value. If they don't help your reader, don't use them. Here's a pro move. Use perplexity to fact check your content before you publish. Copy your draft. Paste it into perplexity. Here's the exact prompt. Fact check all the statistics, claims and data points in this content and verify them against the most current sources. It will check every claim against current sources, tell you what's accurate and what needs updating. This is insane. You just got a free fact checker that uses live data. No more worrying if your stats are outdated. No more getting called out for bad information. You can use this to create pillar content, the kind of massive in-depth articles that rank for everything, the kind that perplexity loves to cite because they're so comprehensive. You're not doing the research. The AI is, you're just directing it and turning the results into content. Here's another feature most people don't know about. Perplexity spaces, you can create a dedicated workspace for each content project, add custom instructions, tell it how to research for your specific niche. For the AI Profit Boardroom, you could create a space just for AI automation content. Here's how to set it up. Create a new space called AI Profit Boardroom Content Research. Then add these custom instructions, focus all research on practical AI automation applications for membership sites and online communities, Prioritize case studies with ROI data and measurable results. Keep language simple and action oriented for entrepreneurs and business owners. Emphasize time saving and efficiency benefits. Now, every search in that space follows those rules. You've basically trained your own research assistant. Here's the bottom line. The old way of doing SEO is dying. Keyword stuffing doesn't work. Low quality content gets ignored. AI search engines are taken over and perplexity is leading the charge. If you want your content to get seen, you need to play by the new rules, clear structure, direct answers, real data, fresh updates, authoritative links, conversational language. That's what works now. And one more thing, if you're creating all this content, but nobody is finding it online, you've got a traffic problem. That's where SEO comes in. If you want more leads, more traffic and more sales, my team can help you rank higher on Google. Check the link in the comments and description to order AI SEO online and let us handle your backlinks while you focus on growing your business. That's it for today. Hit the like and subscribe button and I will see you in the next one.